So do you want to become a DevOps engineer? And you are confused how to start to learn DevOps engineer and where to start to learn DevOps engineer. I hope you may have a lot of doubts uh, related to becoming a DevOps engineer, where to start, how to start, from which topic I have to start to learn DevOps and what is the average salary for a DevOps engineer and what is the scope of a DevOps engineer in future. So I will clarify all these questions in this session guys. So watch till the end of the video then you can understand the complete details of a DevOps job position guys. So then you may have doubt uh, what is DevOps. So DevOps is nothing but a it is a some like a culture guys it's not a role it's, so it must include like a de development as well as operation side. So it is like a end to end process of automate the projects guys. Nowadays DevOps positions are playing a very important role in IT companies guys. So there is a huge demand for DevOps engineers nowadays guys. Okay, so no matter whether you are a non-IT background or computer science background, anyone can learn DevOps course guys and you can easily grab the job. Now let's talk about how to start to learn DevOps concept, where to start, from which topic I have to start and how long time it takes to complete a DevOps course. Okay, we will see those things guys. First, you have to start to learn the foundation concepts guys uh, to become a DevOps engineer before learning uh, the main tools of DevOps job. Okay, so you must learn the foundations concepts like uh, Linux and uh, Python and uh, AWS. First, you have to start to learn Linux concepts. You no need to learn in depth of uh, Linux concepts guys. Minimum Linux knowledge is required guys to become a DevOps engineer. Okay. So who are already having experience in as a Linux administrator, those people can easily understand the concepts. Okay. And then you have to learn the basics of uh, some fundamentals of Python as well, guys, to automate, uh, to automate the backend process. Okay. And you must know AWS. Okay. Amazon Web Services. After learning these concepts, then you have to start to learn the main DevOps tools, guys. So I have divided six parts, guys, to learn this DevOps course. See, guys, each and every topic, every topic takes one month. Every part takes one month, guys. So here, six parts are there, six months. So minimum six months duration, guys, to complete DevOps course. Okay, so first one is you have to learn configuration guys first one you have to learn configuration configuration okay what is the configuration tool nowadays the most demand configuration tool guys terraform so it is one of the most used infrastructure as a core tool guys if you have some time and you want to upgrade skills then you can learn also ansible and this tool this tool takes time to learn one month guys if you practice daily 20 to 30 minutes okay so after learning this uh, tool and you have to learn version control guys version control system like uh, git and uh, github you have to learn some commands from git and github if you have some time then you can learn also gitlab guys okay but these are the you know, but if you have some time, you can learn GitLab also. Okay. And then you have to learn some package manager or containerization like a Docker. Okay. So, and if you have time, you can learn Lambda also. Okay. And then you have to learn some deployment tools like a Jenkins. It's nothing but a one pipeline tool continuous integration and continuous deployment so if you have some time you can learn code deploy so these are all the alternative guys whatever the downside are there these are the alternatives for those tools so after learning uh, some deployment tool then you have to learn some kubernetes tools guys kubernetes or ecs after that you have to learn some monitoring tool like grafana or elk stack so, so these are the most used 
devops tools guys nowadays okay and nobody knows what new tools will introduce in the future but as of now these are the most used tool for this specific for this specific process so to complete end to end process of automation of the projects so each tool takes the one month duration course guys to complete each tool so that means to complete a devops course it takes around six months guys okay so that too you have to practice 30 minutes to one hour per day so then only you will get job after completion of the course guys so without practice you don't expect job guys not only this technology in any technology so while learning the any course you have to practice on the same day only then only you will get then only you will get job then only you will get then only you will get job then only you will get job after completion of the course now you may have doubt what is the average salary for devops engineer position see guys if you have two years or three years of experience in devops engineer then you can expect salary uh, like uh, 6 lakhs to 10 lakhs guys it depends on the company and the location and depends on your skill set as well and also your and also based on your entry performance suppose if you are very good all devops tools then you can expect up to 11 or 12 lakhs also with 3 years of experience suppose if you are 4 year suppose if you are above 5 years of experience in devops engineer then you can expect up to 17 to 18 lakhs or 19 or 20 also it depends on the company and location if you are very worth candidate then it companies will pay you what you are expecting but you must know some but you must have strong skills in devops okay now let's talk about what is the scope of uh, devops in the future so devops has a very bright future guys Do, no doubt in that okay so if anyone want to learn in devops course then you can immediately then you can immediately start to learn that course guys in the future everything will go to Uh, in the future everything will uh, develop the projects uh, in the automation process only so devops is also nothing but it is a end to end automate process to complete their uh, it projects okay so that's all guys for this session so, so if you have any doubts please comment in the comment box guys okay and uh, if you feel this video is very helpful then don't forget to share to your friends guys okay So we'll meet with one more useful content video. Thank you very much.